What up Dapper Squad, it's your boy Darius back at it again with some more free run Beyond Journeys in. Absolutely beautiful show. Today we're doing episodes three and four, finishing the official introduction or prologue to the story because I know all four episodes dropped when this show started. I am loving it so far. Hopefully you guys are. If you are, please leave a like on this video. Let me know your thoughts down below in that comment section. As always, subscribe. And if you guys want the early access to the other shows or the full length uncut versions of these ones, check out that Patreon. Links are down below like always. I'm not going to waste any more time. Let's hop right into today's episodes three and four. Let's do it. 27 years after the death of Himmel in a trade city of Warm, located in the Central Lands. I love the little narration. I love the very beautiful music they play. It really makes me feel like I'm not like in a fantasy world. I'm not like an inn drinking some, some mead, you know? I'm really enjoying their relationship. <laughs> the symbolism of the birds leaving, splitting apart. Birds gonna follow her. I agree. Who knows what crazy thing she's gonna buy this time. She looks like Gon when Gon is given like a math problem and he overheats. I love anime cats. They're always so cute. I could go for a good dessert. I don't, I, I don't think this place would know about the sweet desserts. <laughs> yeah. I want, wow. They actually gave her information. Shout out to them and wrong for me for misjudging them. Yeah, you better get that going and meet her at the end. You've been following her the whole day. That's why she gathered that information so they could share a sweet treat together. I like that. I'm still curious about the accessory she bought. That is a beautiful view. フリーレン様。痛がってすみませんでした。気分を。メルクアプリンですよね。Is I do love some sour grapes. Oh, we know yours. Either. <laughs> we did pour one out, pour two out for Hyter on his grave, man. R.I.P. Wow, those look delicious. Oh. I like how she thinks back to them and how she lacked a certain need to get to know them and now she wants to change that with all the humans she interacts with in the future, you know? Shout out Free Run, and I knew this would be for her. Shout out Fern too. Is that a butterfly? Oh, I like that. That's half the effort. Imagine living in a place like this. Just with that view. I do like that hair ornament. It looks real nice. And the symbolism of the two birds leaving together now. But they don't need to do shots like that or a lot of the shots they do in the show. But, you know, I, like Madhouse is low-key flexing their animation budget. That's what I've been wondering. Oh, 
でもできる限りはヒンメルたちとの冒険の痕跡をたどっていきたいかな。Like that. 風化する前に。In Twenty-seven years since Himmel died. I wonder if Ison's still alive. Wow, Fern is getting tall. Sixteen. Free runs what, like a hundred? She's thinking of her chest. I mean, that's just—I don't know if it's elf genealogy, but twenty-seven years after the death of Himmel in Grobe, Grobe Forest, located in the Central Land. See, I love that they just give me a little. Timelines we know Himmel dying was like the you know uh, AD and BC Doing some magic practice We're planning out how you should react in certain situations shout out. I love how it split around the shield Oh Ooh. This is why we do this training. Because mage apprentices die all the time, like Freerun said. Okay, with a fully defensive round barrier? Kind of going crazy right now. Enough practice like that by the time Fern is like. 30, you know, she'll be a very excellent mage. Now that I know how strong Freerun is and they defeated the Demon King and all of this, I, I just want to see her go full out against something. I doubt there's ever going to be that much of a threat in this show, but I would love to see it. It can't be Hyter, it can't be Himmel. They've been expecting, I mean, they know of a white haired elf named Freerun, so. Qual? The hell? Or Qual was sealed? The Elder Sage of Corruption? See, now I want to see that whole fight. That seems crazy. Shout out him. Good dude, man. Gotta check yearly. <laughs> So they've been anticipating this. Again, Himmel's the, the goat. Oh, he is sealed all right. He's right there, stationary. Holy smoke. I like his design. That looks like a fucking demon creature. Looks like some uh, demon you'd seen like Black Clover. Even among the Demon King's forces, he was exceptional. Zoltrak, the first piercing spell. Ooh. Ooh. Way they're animating this. Oh. Even if you had the most powerful defensive spell or the most magic resistant armor, it just go right through it like it was nothing. Touche. I'm hoping I see as well. I like how I'm in the same book as like Fern a lot of the times. Like I'm asking questions. I want to know. All right, let's see it. Size differences. Hey, you can talk. Oh, we beat his ass. I'm a little nervous because that goes through defensive spells, right? Or. Burns been taught well. 
Is that what Free Run's been using during teaching? I mean, obviously, she's not going to kill Fern, but. So Fern can get accustomed to some strong ass offensive spells. Somewhat smart. Okay. As time has gone on, we've analyzed, incorporated, and developed. I like it. Yeah, you're fucking. You're of the past, buddy. Now it's just that's okay. That's why Fern said that. Just the spell you use on the daily now. So he's just gonna keep doing it until you're out of mana. Okay, they are truthfully snapping on this animation. I love she's doing what she was told, blocking individual spots at the moment of impact. Save up as much mana as she can. And then a big one to try to try to throw her off. But no, shout out Fern! While Freerun is doing some the music is going crazy right now. With your own spell too. That went crazy with the music. I love the way he's withering away. That was bad to the ass. Shout out Free Run and Fern. That's what that hole was? I thought that was just visuals. She shot through the entire cliffside. I guess it's the piercing magic. That's insane. Shout out Free Run, man. <笑>私のスカートめくったクソガキだな。いい。あ、ショーイマインド。ブロザー <laughs> 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 When I tell you this music just hits, man. The scenic shots, the music. This makes me feel like I'm in a fantasy world. I just want to go to a tavern and drink some mead. See, like, it's like side quests like that that expand the world building because that was a quick ass episode. On to episode four. This is Seems to have been another year, at least a few months, because now we're 28 years after the death of Himmel. Damn. That'd be very handy for you and Fern to clean up this area. That's exactly what she wants. Anything about magical history or spells? Uh -huh. Fern is definitely getting taller, and they can immediately tell. Are never real. The legendary mage. Ooh, I want to learn more about him now. I respect it, even if it is a fake. Take it as payment, help anyway. This is what I want over here, where I live in Washington. Give me some snow. W bread baker lady. Looks like they've been staying a while. Three months. I love a very close knit small community like this. Where they treat each other well, you know. Throwing extra bread for you. W ladies. She sleeps in the weirdest positions, bro. She's like me waking up. One of the most powerful mages we've seen in the show. <laughs> hey, she's not a morning person. I need my morning tea. She needs her morning coffee, you know? <laughs> it's literally me. Never related to an elf mage more. She went from I'm your big sister to now I'm your mother. <laughs> 
Alright, I'm not sleeping until noon, but like, me and Freerun are still. That's hilarious. That's the real question. I'm sure Himmel or Heiter or Aisen had to force her up. I'm sure a fire of that size feels lovely how cold it is. Damn, some good soup with some good bread? Ain't much better than that, I won't lie to you. Timeless staple. So they just break up as much wood as they can, bring it over, and then burn it all. Makes sense. Mm. It is the sunrise. <laughs> That's funny. Huge shout out to Fern for actually getting free run shit in line, you know? Oh, okay. Fucking... Is that Gold Roger? Found some old treasure. Some kelp. See, like a shot like that with the animated water is just flexing, you know? Like, shout out Madhouse. They did a wonderful job. That looks much better. Reminds me of Deku from season one of My Hero. Yeah, you guys are a party. They're your they're friends, you know? The same way during the era meteor shower, you know? She fell asleep no matter how hard she tried. I do want to learn more about the elves as a whole. I wonder how many I'm going to see, or if Freerun's going to be the only one. I've seen dwarfs, humans. I don't think I've seen a sunrise in God knows how long. It does look very nice, reflecting off that clear water. That's the thing with events like this. It doesn't necessarily need to be the best event, but as long as you're sharing it with people you love, you know, then it elevates it to a whole other level. That's why I like them having that one last adventure with him on high turn ice and, you know, for that meteor shower. Events like that are always better with company. Praying. I love how they even have differing religious views, you know. あるべきものだと思います。なぜだ。その方が都合がいいからです。必死に生きてきた人の行き着く先が無であっていいはずがありません。Like His hands have definitely... Oh, he's still here? Shout out Aisen, man. He's still doing it in honor of that day. That shit hits, man. I know. I'm here to hang out like you're visiting your friend down the block. Hundred and fifty years, who knows? Not even I've lived that long. I do want to know 
how old she is. I want to see other elves. I want to know her parentage, everything, you know. Oh, that's huge. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, it's a her. I thought Flamin was a man. I apologize. Okay, Aisa still got that strength. She has that magic that can turn grapes into sour grapes, right? Okay, running on water? Old man still has his touch, old dwarf. Being able to fly as a mage would be so dope. I mean, if you've ever played Dungeons and Dragons or Baldur's Gate, you can most definitely speak with the dead. Cut out them. Thousand years? I'm dancing in the palm of my master's hand? Like, I would love to know more about that. Uh, those are the earrings Fern has. Or not Fern, Freerun. Her master is gorgeous. That's her master. After a thousand years, returned, and that's why she's still dancing on the palm of her. She knew this would happen. I do like how it seems the earrings she wears were flames, and that's how she can tell like most of them were fake. And she would—that's insane. Oh, I want to see so many more flashbacks now. <laughs> Are you sure you haven't been around since prehistoric times? Already open to that very page. Flame didn't know you would have regrets about not getting to know people. That's like some 500 IQ shit right there. Wow, I love her look. Everyone always just talks bad about her. Shout out Hyter. This was her, her home, right? Where that little sapling grew up. That is a Demon King's castle. Holy smokes. Is that going to be our goal? Go to the land where souls find rest? Yeah, she was calling Flame irresponsible and carefree. Look at her. Depends on who you ask, but I think yes. She doesn't really know how to be a master. Yeah, even though they are student and teacher, you know, like they seem to be just like such good friends. I do agree with that. <laughs> Aisen, especially knowing her back in the day, could tell how much she's changed and how she's developing as a person. And a teacher, you know. I hope we get to see you again, buddy. At least before you die. I don't know the dwarf's age limit, but you're a real one. 
All these areas that we get to go and watch this happen. All throughout season one, I'm down. Look over her. It took us... It was a ten year journey. Yeah, the music in this show is fantastic, I will say. Oh, so that was the official prologue. I now know what our goal and our the plot of this show, and I'm eagerly excited for it. Absolutely amazing first four episodes. I am the utmost invested already in the, the relationship, not only between Fern and Freerin, but I love how they do the pacing of time so well with us mainly getting Freerun's perspective, how little time is for her, but then cutting back maybe even decades ago to things and how the small little things, maybe it's uh, the boy who flipped up her skirt or maybe it's a conversation with Himmel, you know, and how much impact that has, even on someone who can live to be a thousand years old, you know? So I love the fact that she's Flame's best student. I love Flame so far. I want to see much more flashbacks with her. The music, the animation, the designs. There's like nothing about this show that's lackluster in the slightest. So it's it's super. And I'm sure I haven't even gotten any like the really hype moments. I'm sure it's so obvious as to how this is becoming as well loved and as as popular as it is. Because this is just it's so easy and phenomenal to watch, you know, like I'm super curious where this is going to go. I can't wait to see end day the demon king's castle to go to a rule whatever it's called the place where souls lay rest like know what sort of magic i love the the magical system and the world building in general how they threw that in with um zoltrak and and the demon mage that we fought like it's qual it's super well done i'm super invested I, it's crazy that we only knew him for a couple episodes but ice and himmel and hydra are like the goats like i love them so much overall just Great episodes, man. Free run. I'm I'm in there. So definitely expecting more of this. Hopefully, if you guys enjoyed, please leave a like on this video. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Like I said, check out that Patreon if you guys want the full uncut versions. I'll be here much more consistently. I'm super excited. Don't forget to drink some water. Tell someone you love them, especially after you know watching a show like this. You gotta tell those around him. You never know what might happen. Peace out, Adapter Squad.